Welcome back. There are hundreds of homeless people in Memphis on any given day. And one local ministry, well, is trying to change that. And it's local. Good news. Drive around Memphis, and we see it on just about every street corner. A homeless person needing help. A year ago, you may have seen Antonio Smith standing on the side of the road, holding a sign and asking for money or food. When you're in a position to where you feel like no one cares, you, you start to develop hopelessness. But hope did come for Antonio through the organization Seeds of Greatness. I was holding the sign, actually, and he just pulled up out of nowhere and, and paid my room for me. There's so many people out there that are in need of shelter. Seeds of Greatness founder Jason Murphy says he was teaching Sunday school when God told him to start SOG and help the homeless and single mothers. It doesn't have to be big. It could be small. But you have something to offer. Offering and paying for Antonio's room that night changed his life. He now lives in a hotel and helps other homeless people that used to be on the street with him. Antonio says because of the seed Jason planted, he is able to pay it back in some form. There's still people out there that live, you know, that have less than I have, I guess is the best way to say it. And so it's nothing for them to say, Tony, do you mind if I come sleep on the floor? Or do you mind if, you know, and, and the, the answer is usually always yes, because I can easily be back, you know, right along beside them. You know, it, it's not much, but, you know, when, it, when it's been raining for three days, it, it's something to get out of the rain, you know? And, a lot of people don't see that. You don't, don't see that side of it. Anything helps. Just a prayer or a smile. And that's local good news. And Seeds of Greatness also gives food baskets to the homeless. If you would like to help, just go to our website and click on the green Find It button. There you'll find ways to donate food or volunteer. And remember, we love local good news. So if you have a story that you would like for me to cover, just send me an email to goodnews at localmemphis.com. You can also send me a message on our Facebook page, or you can tweet me, find me at Local24Katina. And Chase is up next with a seven-day forecast. Stay with us.